Hey, it's Susie. I'm going to show you how to use the first name personalization field in a Kajabi email. It's pretty basic, but it confused me at first because I don't have a first name field in my people records. I only have a name field. So I'll show you how Kajabi separates those to use that personalization field in an email. So you're in Kajabi, you're editing your email. You're going to go up and select from the personalization drop down first name comma and see this confused me that that was even an option because if I go into my people records and edit details and look at the fields I don't have a first name field anywhere so I didn't know where Kajabi was pulling that from so I was testing look at my other options there's first name last name and name are my personalization field options in an email. So here's just another example. I sent this email with first name, last name, name, and then this is how it came through. Susie Hines and Susie Hines were all separated out. So Kajabi just knows how to do that. Um, it will take your name field and then separate it into first and last automatically. My other question then was about if I have a form that has these field names, name and email, I didn't know what people would you know, choose to put there. So what you can do is go into your Kajabi Assistant, search for form fields, and then in name, you can rename this and Kajabi will give you a little warning. You can you should only use a synonym of name. And I just add full name to make it more clear, I think. So you save it there in your settings. And then if you go back to that form and refresh, it'll appear as full name, which I think is more clear for your audience. 